As you probably know, Colts tight end Jack Doyle is a local guy. He graduated from Cathedral High School. This is his ninth season with the team, and he and the other players are busy prepping for Monday night's game in Baltimore. But Jack is also getting ready for a big event off the field. It's a second annual All-Star Bowl for the Day Spring Center here in Indianapolis. It's October 18th, and I spoke to him after practice earlier this week about the fundraiser and why this is so important to him. All right, Jack Doyle, good to see you. Colts tight in, teaming up with Day Spring Center. This is a family emergency shelter in Indy that I know a lot of people know about, but others do not. So I want to start with that and why this is so important to you um, to be involved. Yeah, it's something that um, that honestly the the Colts uh, Colts got me connected to. Uh, I guess it was yeah a few years ago now, and and, and myself and my wife Casey. Uh, uh, got to meet some of the kids and some of the families over there and immediately were attached um, and have been working with them uh, uh, ever since. All right, so you do this All-Star Bowl. It is coming up on Monday, October 18th. And who's bowling? And I need to know if you're any good also. I need to have some fun with this interview <laughs> as well. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, no, we'll have a, a you know, we, we started this uh, a couple years ago and then and then missed out on it last year, obviously, with the, with the pandemic. Um, so we're excited to have it back going, and uh, it, it's a great fundraiser, and, uh, and it's my type of fundraiser, you know, more so than having a sit-down dinner mm. or, or something like that where we all, we all get to go out and, and, and do an activity, and, and we'll have some, have some of my teammates out there, and, and, and um, you know, we'll have some great, uh, great businesses and, and companies from, from around the, the local area that will be out there to, to help support it, and uh, we're very thankful for that. Um, so yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun. I'm I'm not a great bowler. Mm -hmm. um, it seems like bowling's one of those things. You, I feel like I do like once every mm -hmm. once every year at this. So yeah. uh, so not a lot of practice, but uh, but always it's always fun. I, you know, I'm the, uh, the kid comes out of me whenever I'm doing any type of, of sport or, or thing like that. Uh, uh, so I always have fun. You're a little competitive, I know as well. And I'm with you on the you know if I can wear jeans and a t-shirt to something. I'm all in. But if I have to dress up and sit down at a dinner, I'm like, oh, my goodness. But let's – I know you mentioned a little bit about COVID and how that changed things um, last year. It's good to be back this year. You found a right way, though, to raise money for Day Spring last year, even through COVID, right? Uh, yeah, we did. We did a, 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 a virtual uh, a virtual fundraiser, and uh, we did it through uh, through uh, touchdowns that the team was scoring. We were, we were, we were giving money back to, to Day Spring, and uh, – and we were able to do uh, the, the, you know, the the main reason, not the only reason, but the main reason we do the the fundraiser is for uh, for what we do is a called a birthday party. So we do a, a in the spring we try to we get all the kids and the families together and, and we throw everybody a birthday party on the on the same day. So they all get to celebrate their own birthday. Where we, you know, we've done top golf in the past and and, and had cake and we've done um dave and busters in the past and uh, and had a ton of fun and again some teammates will always come out for that and, and and interacting with the kids and and that's my that's my favorite part of it you know this is this is kind of uh you know the the help raise money and and to give back to day spring and things like that but my my part my favorite part will always be the interaction that we actually get to have with the kids and and you know my boys are getting older and having them interact with the kids and uh it's just a ton of fun wow well thank you so much for giving us your time and your energy and and doing something so great for our community we're so glad you guys got a win i mean it was interesting that you know we were talking ah, it's so and then now you're one game out of first place so good job we want you to keep winning and good luck to you guys and thanks for joining us yeah thank you for having me Okay, so again, the All-Star Bowl, Monday, October 18th. Only a few lanes are left if you want to take part. If you're interested in reserving the spot, fox59.com slash links is the place to go.